quick video to use up the last of these um, small meatballs that I made uh, for a dish that didn't work out entirely but it was very nice so I'm just cooked some pasta or some spaghetti um, drained it uh, put it in the pan I've added a little bit of the pasta water so there's a little bit of pasta water in there and it's combined with the starch from the pasta and that's kind of what's going to uh, start off uh, forming the sauce so basically going to make like a cheese sauce it's the starch from the pasta uh, and the uh, water in there combined with the cheese is going to make like a bit of a, a cheesy a cheesy sauce so pasta's cooked it's seasoned it's got some pepper in there as well so about it's 200 grams worth of pasta and then uh, about 75 grams worth of cheese and then what you do is you mix all that together we turn the heat off and then the heat of the pasta will cook the cheese and form the sauce it's the basis it's the basic idea for cacio e pepe and um, pasta la grigia I can't pronounce them I'm sorry and uh, carbonara uh, where you form the sauce in the pan from the pasta water and the cheese you don't actually make the cheese, uh, cheese sauce separately you just kind of make the cheese sauce in the pan from the pasta water and the cheese and a little bit of fat but we haven't got a little bit of fat it doesn't matter it's formed a nice enough cheese as it is and then we've just heated up the see how it's formed the sauce from the bottom of the pan so it's gone creamy so there you go and then we've just got these leftover meatballs which they're going to go in there if you were to not make the cheese sauce first in, uh, cook the pasta in the cheese first it would it wouldn't kind of work in the same way um, the cheese would just want to cook cook um, stick to the um, meatballs which is not what you want so there we go so as always a little bit of sauce and lots of pasta and that out of the way and then we'll twiddly 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 and find the fork Get that out of the way as well. And now let's take a picture. Um, so let's move that around that way. Then you don't see the dirty cooker. So we'll use the same bowl. I'll have another one. Picture? No, I've got another one. Let's use a clean bowl. And that's why I always give myself too much washing up. So, twilly, twilly, twilly. So all the sauce and the cheese is combined on the pasta, so there's nothing. Although I've just made a mess of that. And then twilly, twilly, twilly. And then we'll plonk some meatballs on top. Although I'm at home really, and I'm by myself. So I could do a um, Alex Honnold and just eat out of the pan. So if you don't know who Alex Honnold is, he's a famous um, mountain climber. Well, did a film called Free Solar, and in the documentary, he doesn't wash up, he just cooks everything in a pan, and eats out of the pan to save on washing up. So, I don't think he does that anymore, he's got himself a girlfriend. There we go, right, we'll take a, we'll take a picture, and we're back.